Mr. Speaker, today's enforcement action in Wet'suwet'en territory was another humiliating stain on Canada's relationship with Indigenous people. The Canadian Constitution and the United Nations recognize the rights and title of Indigenous people. The Supreme Court recognizes the Indigenous hereditary systems of government. Nation-to-nation -nation negotiations are the responsibility of this government. Mr. Speaker, why has the government abandoned its duty and allowed the constitutional and legal rights of the Wet'suwet'en hereditary chiefs to be violated today?